New authorities are looking into who owns a pack of bulldogs that attacked a 15-year-old boy and, and an elderly man in Pasco. ABC Action News reporter Eric Waxler just arrived on scene. And Eric, can you tell us how those victims are doing right now? Yeah, we're in the Shady Hills area of Pasco County, uh, just off the Veterans Expressway near Cruz Lake Park. I talked to the son-in-law of the elderly victim who was uh, injured in this dog attack. They live right here at this house. He tells me that his father-in-law was going to check the mail when he was attacked by these bulldogs, a pack of bulldogs, and he was severely injured with bites on his hands and legs. He is at the hospital right now getting stitched up, but the sheriff's office uh, believes that he will be okay. They uh, say that the teenager, he was going perhaps to wait on a school bus down this road here when he was attacked uh, by the same group of dogs. His bites not to believe to be too uh, serious. His injuries are minor, according to the sheriff's office. We know that a deputy shot at one of the dogs. We don't know the condition of the dog, uh, any of the dogs at this point, or whether they were taken in by animal control. Neighbors say the dogs are from a house just a few doors down, uh, but those people just recently moved in, so there wasn't a whole lot of information on them. Live in Pasco County, Eric Waxler, ABC Action News.